Hi guys, you're with Magali. We're here at CS Sweet Pool Party, after party, and I got DJ Tisha with me. Hey, hello, I'm Tisha, what up, what up? <laughs> so, Tisha is the newest member of uh, Trigger Production, I heard. Yes, yes, uh, I recently joined Trigger Production. Uh, last week was my welcoming party, so yeah, it's been a week. Yeah. It's been a week, it's only been a week. So, have you? how long have you been starting DJing? I started DJing uh, like uh, late 2013, so this is like going to my second year of DJing. Nice, nice. nice. So how did it all start? It It started as of in, in a funny way because I used to be I used to be a dancer, yes. and I like in my crew whenever we're about to perform, like we always thought like, hey, uh, can someone like mix our song? You know, when you're performing dancing, like you need someone to mix your song, and they always said like my girls always said like, hey, one of us need to be a fucking DJ. So whenever we want to perform, we don't need to find someone else to mix our song. I said like, I was like, I'll be a DJ. Yeah. It wasn't. It was joking. It was joking. But then like my friends are like, Hey, you love music. You love R&B, hip hop. Why don't you start? So at that time, I was I was doing nothing. Yeah. I'm on I'm on break. I don't I don't uh, I don't have any I don't have any job at that time. I'm free. So I said like, Hey, um, maybe I'll take a DJ course. Yeah. So what are the plus and minuses about being? Well, in Indonesia, we say female DJ, but it's just DJ, right? Yeah, yeah. It's only in Indonesia that yeah. people call it FDJ. Yeah. Around the world, it's just DJ. Yeah. It doesn't matter whether it's a girl or it's a guy. Yeah. Just DJ. It's it's a stereotype here. They put well, like the F yeah. DJ. I hate but it's it. all about the music, right? It's, it's all about, about it's about it's all for the love of the music. Yeah. So, what's the plus and minus of being a DJ that is female in this industry? <laughs> The plus is, oh my god, music is so loud. Uh, I don't know about the plus, yeah. I mean, like, the plus is maybe, I'm not sure. Yeah. Like, it's, I think it's the same with yeah. female or male, it's the same. But the minus is, I have a lot of minus. Like, but the, the Indonesian people stereotype of female DJ is, you know, the sexy, they have to dress yeah. really sexy, like showing skins, you know, and that instead of music wise, yeah. music scales. So that's like the minus because Indo people yeah. thought of female DJ. They're like the you know the sexy yeah, is. But DJ Mag is coming to Indonesia. Yeah. What do you think about that? I am so overwhelmed. It's like next year, yeah. yeah. Next year you're gonna you're gonna like print your actual uh, copy, yeah here, yeah. Yeah, I'm so overwhelmed because like uh, recently uh, last month summer uh, summer edition, yeah. I got interviewed by uh, DJ Mag ASEAN, 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 DJ Mag ASEAN. Yeah, so like when I found out like oh. They're gonna have like the DJ make yeah. Indo. That's so cool. That's so cool. Cause, like they have like they have the cool reviews of DJs around the world, local DJ yeah. also. Those are really cool. I'm looking forward to yeah. it. Okay, last one. A little shout out to all your fans and to DJ Mag and Dreamfield Festival. Like hey everyone, I'm Tisha. Um, we're at Dreamfield's after party. The vibe is so good. It's a pool party chilling. I wanna give a shout out to DJ Mag Indo, breathing, living, dance music. And there you have it, Tisha.